Hello. Ali, thank you so much for that resub. Marcus and Orc, thanks for contributing to the community goal. Did we do it? We're really close. We're like really, really close. Also, like the screen is so red. <laughs> That's funny. Um, uh, hi. It's been like some time since I've been uh, streaming. I'm excited to be back. Um, small, quick announcement. Tomorrow, we're gonna be, uh, at least I'm gonna be observing whatever the, um, the, the protest, which is exclamation point. DVD, a little information about that. Do better day. Uh, protesting the hate raids that have been happening on the Twitch platform. I wasn't super aware of it, to be honest, until uh, someone informed me about it today, and I was like, well, sure. Yeah, for, for sure. I, I support this cause. Why not? So, in St. Luke's stream tomorrow, we're going to be playing some community games on Discord, maybe watching a movie or something. It's going to be a fun time over on that Discord. I'm going to have a link to everything in my discord our discord the clubhouse um after the stream i'm gonna go and compile all of the information and put it out in announcements so there's that second secondly we have a new question of the day if you feel like if you feel like uh posing the question exclamation point q um otherwise i'm really excited to play this game i have been um I have been itching to play this. Yeah, so the question of the day is, will you pay full price for a game or do you wait for sales? I like always wait for sales. It has to be like a very specific release <laughs> for me to buy it at full price. And I, it doesn't even really matter what the cost of the game is. I'm like, if it doesn't have a percent off in front of it, I feel like I'm being scammed. <laughs> You know, I, I don't know. Oh, I forgot to start recording. Oh, that's fine. I'm just, I'm gonna have to grab it off of Twitch. Whatever, no biggie. Um, but yeah, do both depending on the hype for the game. I think there's only like two or three games that I've paid like full price for intentionally. Ooh, a cat a treat, give a cat a treat. Also, hello, welcome in. Give me, let me, let me shake a bag at the door we'll see we'll see who comes up let's see I heard, I heard Harvey like stretch and shake, but he hasn't come over yet. Come on, buddy. Take bets on which cat shows up. You got another minute or two. Seamus, thanks for that lurk. I appreciate it. Yarn Pumpkin, thanks for the follow. Ugh. I'll just leave. Oh, there he is. Come here, buddy. Come on. He has been so wary since I went on vacation. Come here. He had to spend like a whole week by himself. A poor thing. Come back and he's like, I'm afraid. Come here, buddy. Oh, he's not interested. He just left. I'll give him five minutes. If he doesn't come back, I'll refund your points. <laughs> Usually Ellie's the treat one. Oh my god, I've been sitting for so long the game's like, All right, could you please? Could ya? All right, all right. Let's, let's get into this. Okay. Uh, oh, and then Orc says, new fighting games equal full price, anything else, sale. Fair, yeah, fair. 
Yeah, for me, I'm, I, Horizon's probably going to be a, a launch day game for me. Ah, finally. I have a known bot in my chat. Um, which, which one is it? Ali, do you mind taking care of that? If you're able? Ah, finally. I thought for a second you would never wake up, little one. How ironic that I would have been. How ironic that would have been, would it not? I'm Charon. The spirit fairer. Well, that is, that is what I have been until your arrival. I cannot say that I'm sad to leave, but I still had a few things left to do here. Thank you, Allie. Spend your eight hour stream fighting bots. <laughs> I'm afraid you will have to pick up things where I left them. It is, after all, my very last day. And you are? Stella. Stella. Welcome, Stella. I see you've brought a friend here with you. What's his name? Do we get to name the cat? Aww, Daffodil. That's cute, though does look like a little, little daffodil. I see. You two will share the burden, then, and take it over from me. As I said in a few minutes, I will be gone from this world, and that's why you are here. You'll be the new spirit fairer. Listen, your task here will be far from easy, but uh, simple nonetheless. Go fetch the stray spirits stranded on the islands, and when they are ready, bring them back here. Dying souls can't pass away on their own. You will have to help them fulfill their last requests, and be at their service until their last breath. We love Daffodil. Daffodil is so cute. I've played the demo for this for anybody, anybody new here. Uh, but I, had, I haven't played the full game. I've watched a little bit of it, but not enough to really, like, know everything. Man, I'm really surprised that Harvey, like, came all the way into the room and then left. Buddy. Alright, here's the question. I don't know if I've ever actually refunded channel points before. Do you just reject it instead of mark it as complete? Is that kind of the the deal? You can share a link uh, for the bot list. Yeah, feel free to whisper it to me. I don't know if it'll let you put it in the chat. I'll figure it out later. I'll figure this out. That's fine. You guys, I'm a new streamer. I'm still working it out. The big round bridge over there is the Everdoor. The Alpha where everything starts, the Omega where everything ends. This is where all the quests get completed, where existence meets its threshold. There is no task more important than this one. Never forget this, Stella. Here, there is something I need to give you. Now be really careful with it. It is the Everlight. I love that just like a couple of words are read aloud. I think that's cool. 
the symbol of your status here and the only tool you will ever need. Wait, what are you? Cat, cat, what are you doing? How highly inappropriate. <laughs> Well, that settles it. The Everlight will help you throughout your travels. It will be the light that shines in the darkness, the last remaining hope of the departed. Oh my god, the cat. <laughs> Hope is a flame, the light that never uh, falters, the beacon of eternity. It's heavy and inconvenient, but there's no greater duty than this one. The fate of lost souls rests on your shoulders. Look, I was overwhelmed, too, at first. Just try to keep your focus. Take it one step at a time. You'll soon get used to this place. Accustomed to these moments. You are the new spirit fairers, after all. Just one thing. Oh, one last thing. Once I'm gone, you will have to find a ship of your own. Mine is not suited for you, and it will fade away once I'm gone. You might find one not too far from here, if you keep rowing in the right direction for some time. Probably. Okay. It's time. Here I go. So long, Stella, and good luck. You will need it. I'm ready for this game to just be, like, beautiful. Like, constantly. Welcome back, Harvey. Would you like a treat now? I've only been streaming for about two months. What what kind of games have you been streaming? Uh, come on. Don't you want this? He's like, yes, but I don't trust you. He's like watching. If I put it like right on the edge here. We'll see. We'll see. All right. Uh, that's jump. Cool. Well, Harvey will join us if he wants to. Ah! I thought I could fall through the floor. Hold B to jump higher. Alright. Yeah, there we go. What? Oh, I went too far! Uh, curses. Yeah, we did it. Did it. Hello. Mm -hmm. Stella. Decida series. I'm not familiar with that. Do a lot of retro. If I can find anyone who wants to play Raft soon. Oh, cool. All right. I'll have to look those up. I'm not, I'm not super well versed on retro games. So they're all new to me. Um, it really is you. Standing up straight and let me get... Stand up straight and let me get a look at you. Mm. You look good. And Daffodil is here too, I see. Mm. We'll have to find a lint roller then. Uh, it might not be that obvious after all. Mm. It's me. Gwen. Good thing you found me. Mm. But if you're here, it means... Oh. You are the new spirit fairer. Mm -hmm. 
You are the new one. You are the one replacing Charon. I was trying to get rid of him and only ended up here by accident. I've been stuck on this disgusting island for about a week, living off sardines and cigarettes. Funny how I used to be the one getting you out of trouble before. I can see you have an Everlight now, of course. See that boat over there? That's a big boat. Tactical RPG, like Final Fantasy Tactics. Got it. Cool. That's the one. It's obviously slightly shabby, but let's commandeer it. I'll wager, wager it work. <laughs> I'm so tongue-tied. I'd wager it will work since you're the spirit fair. Okay, meet me on the deck over there. I'll explain it all. Cool. Do we take fall damage in this game? I guess not. That's that's like a, a little clever bit of design that we can't like accidentally go and explore that area without doing the, the drop down tutorial. Damn it. Did not account for me just being bad at games. Jump. Keep going. Down. Yes. Well, I guess I could have just done that and skipped the dialogue anyways, but whatever. Found our boat. We got a boat. So in the tutorial, or not in the tutorial, in the um, demo, the boat was already like kind of filled out. All right. I'm going to close the door and try to pick up Harvey. Wish me luck. RV was acquired. He says hi. Alright, buddy, you want some treats? Yeah, there you go. Yeah, we got some treats for Harvey. We did it. It took an extra step or two, but we got there. Beast. All right. Over here. Okay, here goes. Hope my fur coat won't be too damaged. What? Mm -hmm. Wonderful. I'm not one to jump for joy, but this feels good. Much better than anticipated. Mm -hmm. So, the way I see it, this boat is yours now. Don't you think? Good. And as you're the spirit fair welcoming stray spirits, it is your new job. It is your new job. And once aboard, they will assume their true forms. Mm -hmm. Well, it's my theory anyways. Kendrowski, thank you so much for the for the for the resub. Thank you. Oh, we lost Harvey. Oh, well, all right. He'll come back. He's locked in here now, so he'll either start screaming or he'll hang out. We'll see. But thank you so much for that resub. I really appreciate it. Um, Why are you looking at me like that? You need to come here and give me a hug. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Is, the, is, this, the, is this the best part of the game? Aww. Yeah. Oh, so happy. Much better. Come with me now. Let's take a look at this chaos. Ah. Oh no. What a mess. Reminds me of Aunt Petunia's old yard. A beautiful unorganized testament to someone's laziness. Or a vital impossibility to get rid of anything. At any rate, we should do something about this, or my dust allergies will be back. Let mm -hmm. me think. There's only one way to clean this up. You have to meet Albert. Mm -hmm. He's your local shipwright. 
And his jokes are garbage. Because <laughs> yeah, there's garbage on this ship. It's a pun. <laughs> he is the only one who can fix your boat. Hmm. We should head to Albert's shipyard. You must be wondering how to make the ship move. It's really easy, actually. There, let me give you this key I found on the island. It will unlock the cabin in the back. Mm -hmm. You should find a map projector in there. How do I know all this? Well, I was planning an escape, mm -hmm. remember? And you know me. I plan things meticulously. Very mm -hmm. meticulously. Go, open up that cabin, mm -hmm. Stella. The map projector should be simple enough to use, and you just have to go to Albert's <laughs> shipyard. I feel like I should start spelling that out when it's in all caps in a different, uh... Thank you. New. Albert Shipyard. Would it let me... No. Maybe. It'd be kind of funny if it let me go to the Everdoor. Just like disregard what they said completely. Let's do it. Oh, I'm so glad that that this game went on sale today. Um, so I was like trying to figure out what to play and I was like kind of between games and I was just like, I'm still just really salty about Twin Mirror. And so I like really didn't want to play a game that I wasn't sure about and then get disappointed by, you know? And I knew that this was going to be good. Um, but I didn't want to get it at full price, and then just coincidentally the game went on sale for, like, one of the highest sales that has, that there has been for this game. And I was just immediately bought it and installed it. <laughs> this is very pretty. But there are a couple other games on my list that I'll get to eventually. I want to play Night in the Woods at some point. Ooh. Jump. Yeah. Ah. Got him. Can I sit? I can, I can sit and wait. Oh, we've had the cat! Harvey, come! <laughs> Harvey, please. Harvey. He's just looking at me like. Nah, no thanks, nah. You're gonna pick me up, I know it. Oh, I just noticed that it has a little like uh, timer at the top. It kind of gives you an idea of how long it'll take. That's cool. Got a pillar. Shipyard! We did it! The background is really lovely. Just having... Albert Shipyard discovered! We did it. You guys, we beat the game. Here we are. Hey. Now head down to Albert Shipyard and upgrade your blueprint station. It's the only way to clear this clutter. I'm curious about uh, what it's all made of. Hey. Considering the smell, I'd say at least seven different types of dust and dirt. Got our magic paddle. Hell yeah. Over here, welcome to my shipyard, young traveler. Where my prices are a customer's best friend. I'm Albert. Been in the business of shipbuilding for ages. Should I assume you are the new spirit fair? Well, of course you are. Anyway, you've been able to start this ship and bring it here after all. Gwen was right to point you towards my humble enterprise. Ha, ah, let me see what you have here. Nice little deity. I don't know if I said that. I'm gonna pronounce a lot of things in this game wrong. Just like warning you off the bat. 
Sorry in advance. I should put that as a disclaimer on my stream. I never say words correctly, including usernames. It just... None of it. Um, funny how it looks exactly like the one I built some time ago and stored in my old shipyard. See, Karen was unhappy about his gloomy and dank art. Actually, he was always complaining about everything. But the customer's always right, so I build him a newer, better one. Of course, he would never abandon his previous boat. Old habits die hard, but don't worry, you can keep this one. Let's just call this a loan. And let me tell you something. You know we always joke about the construction here? Don't worry, we're still working on it. Anyway, with a little bit of love, this bird will be uh, resplendent again. The first thing you need is a proper blueprint table. Since it's your lucky day and I'm feeling generous, I'll offer it to you free of charge. Mind you, it's a little bit bare bones in terms of functionality. Did the cat just meow? The cat meowed. You guys, the cat meowed. It was only in the left ear. I heard it though. But the subsequent upgrades will come at uh, such a small price, you'll want to buy them almost immediately. Simply direct me to upgrade the ship. Upgrade. How many do I have? What is this currency? I have zero. So I can't do this. Okay. Mailbox. You'd be able to build and edit your uh, buildings on your boat. What a treat! But if you really want to upgrade your boat in size and in pleasure, I'm your guy. Come back when you feel your boat is getting too crowded. Cheers. You guys, I did it. Did it! I'm still working out the controls a little bit. I keep thinking that B, I'm on Switch. I keep thinking that B is back, but it's actually Y in this game. Finally. Good. Albert gave it to you for free. He said he loaned the ship to you. Ominous. Hard to know what he has in mind, but it doesn't sound reassuring. Anyways, let's focus on the task at hand for now. Cleaning up this deck. You can go to your new blueprint table above the cabin and select the move option. In it, you'll be able to remove any building and get back resources. Go for it. I'll wait here. Oh! I didn't mean to do that. How exciting. Ah! Alright. Edit. What do I do with this? Salvage? Uh, yeah. Did it! Success! Yeah, we have a boat now! You guys, what's our boat's name? Do we get to name the boat? I know Bodie McBoatface has been taken, but... Why? Back. Mm -hmm. Wonderful! I'm the best. I'm the best at this game. You did a wonderful job, Stella. And good news is that you have enough resources to add a guest house to your ship. A necessary anemone. And, and, and then. Oh my god. I can't speak. Harvey just meowed and yawned at the same time. Meow. Mm -hmm. Newly welcomed spirits such as myself have a temporary place to relax and sleep. Well, sleep, not really. I can tell you for sure that no one will be thrilled to spend more than one night in there. Mm -hmm. But it beats sleeping on the deck. These stars are pretty, but the wood is stiff and the humidity is hard to tolerate. I'll leave you to it. Have fun. Alright. Build. Aha! Guest house. I don't know if it really matters at this point where I put it.
And I get the idea that we can always move stuff around. Oh, shit. We can go up. With nothing under it? We can just- we can just put it, like, right in the middle. Oh, that's so tempting. That seems dumb, but it's really tempting. Ooh, okay. Alright. Hmm. Hmm. It, it, it's not efficient. We're gonna go here for efficiency for now. <laughs> you can. <laughs> Allie, how have you been today? I feel like it's been so long. Harvey's being very patient. He's just hanging out. Uh, why? Yes. Very nice. This guest house is very pretty. It has your touch. Nice work as usual. All these compliments are starting to feel a little insincere. We'll see. Now, at last, I have a place to sit down and enjoy the view. Oh, wait. What's going on? Something else is happening. Ah, I should have expected this. I'm actually hungry, very hungry. You know how terrible a cook I am. But remember, but I remember you being absolutely fantastic at it. And you might have fished a few fishes already. Trouble is, I can't really eat an entire raw fish. I could try for sure, but I'll probably choke on the fish bone and never survive. That's not how you want me to go. As absurd as it sounds. So you should keep on using this blueprint table of yours and build a kitchen aboard. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure I've seen plans for it still in there, as well as necessary resources. Damn. You require bright jelly. There, uh, and there is only one way to get some. Look, I should have told you when I first met you here. Something scares the hell out of me. A dark presence, I can't... I even cower from it. A void that swallows all, light included. It can take many forms, and for me, it always for me it, it is always jellyfish. Yes, I'm fully aware of the irony. The bright jelly you need for the kitchen, well, these only these jellyfish can provide it. So there's no other option. I'll have to face my fears. But you're here. With you I can do it. Uh, they will appear as a dark patch of pure fear on your map, so you can't miss it. Go, I'll take some time to prepare myself. <laughs> I get cranky when I'm hungry. Me too. So I can't build this yet, right? Kitchen. Yeah, okay. You're making food. Me three. What are you making? Aha, we got a dark patch. Let's go catch some jellies. Pork chops? Oh, that sounds so good. See? Oh, oh no, come back! When Stella or Daffodil leave the boat, it stops. So we'll restart automatically once everybody's back on board. That's cool. I was just wondering. I'm like, oh god, will it leave without us? I was like a little afraid, but everything was fine. Parkour! Get that parkour. Yeah, parkour! <laughs> it's cute. I really like the, uh, the progress bar at the top here. Oh, is this how I fish? Oh yeah, I remember I fished in the demo. Hey, got a fish. I think we found the jellyfish. 
Hold on, we gotta get this other fish first. All right, perfect, all right. Here we are, mm -hmm. damn. Here they come. Remember, set your eyes on the ones with bright mm -hmm. jelly. They should be visible enough. That said, pop as many as you can, you'll get gleams anyway. I will wait for you inside. It's just too hard for me to stay out there. Okay, go ahead. I believe in you. Hold on. I thought you said you were facing your fears. You're facing your fears from the comfort of your home. Uh, do I just... Oh, they're too high. Oh, God. Ugh. Gimme. Gimme. I should have put the- I should have put the thing in the middle of the- middle of the sky. What was I thinking? It's like this is more fishing so I don't have to go upstairs. It's not real life. Got him. Yes. Oh my god, there's so many. Oh, we gotta get the important one. Got him, got him. That's cool. I never saw this mechanic. Fantastic. Okay. I'm really impressed. You rocked out there. Tumbling and diving like a shooting star. And without the slightest fear nor hesitation, you definitely haven't lost your touch, Stella. And you even gathered enough bright jelly to build a proper kitchen. Go for it. I'll be patiently waiting. Uh, slowly digesting myself. I I should be this dramatic when I'm hungry. Like, I should start saying, like, yeah, no, start dinner. That's fine. I'll just die in the meantime. Waiting. <laughs> that would go over well. It, yeah. Nah. It, it would be, it'd be great. Uh, build. Oh, the kitchen. All right, all right. We, we already have to move some stuff around. This is already a disaster. All right, we're going to move. We're going to edit this. You know, just go up there for now. That's fine. This is already a disaster. Um... The ship has to be perfect. I hope y'all understand. Also, let me know if I should move my camera. I wasn't really sure where the best place to put it was. Because I don't want to, like, cover all the menus. Harvey, oh my goodness. Hold on. Poor thing is suffering. Maybe bottom left. Yeah, maybe that might cover. I, I'll, I'll put it on top right again. I've had it in top right when I started the game, but then there was dialogue there almost immediately. So I'll leave it there for now. If we got to move it, we move it. It's not a big deal. All right. So this the kitchen. Oh, that's kind of cool. I like that. I'm gonna... let's go with that. I like that we can move stuff around for free. That... that makes me really happy. I don't know why, but I'm gonna do that until we have more stuff to build. I... I just... I don't know. I like these different levels. The levels make me happy. 
Oh, whoops. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. Stella. Ah, yes. I forgot to tell you about this. As you can see, the boat stops at night. I believe it's a side effect of your ever light being, well, light. Or some other technicality. That being said, it will allow people to sleep undisturbed. You, in the meantime, can do anything you want, tackle unfinished business, or just chill on the deck under the stars. I suggest you go to sleep, too, in that cozy little room atop your cabin. Mm -hmm. You'll wake up refreshed and ready to go, and this ship will start up again in the morning. Oh, and speaking of that, you know me. Waking up on time has never been my forte. Mm -hmm. You can ring that big bell over there to wake people up. Remember, only do it at the right time. Early morning should do the trick. Speaking of sleep, time for me to take a nap. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Jem, hello. Yeah, Plain Spirit Fair. Really excited about it. Yeah, I like I I had a little bit of light spoiling. Like I I just watched a couple of streams like loosely in the background or like I saw the beginning, but not the... I've already surpassed what I watched. Uh, and Nine, thank you so much for that resub. I really appreciate it. Thank you. How are you both doing today? You know, I want a fish. No, wait, wait, you were hungry, though. I need to feed you. Cook. Fish. Oh, heck yeah, we're cooking. Just got back from the movies. Good times? What'd you see? Free guy. I'm trying to think if I saw a trailer for that. I don't think I did. Maybe? It sounds super familiar. Hold on, hold on. I'm doing the I'm doing the terrible twitch thing or I'm going on my phone. Oh yeah. No, I did see some stuff for this with Ryan Reynolds. Was it good? Channing Tatum's in it too. I liked it a lot, but Nine said it was enjoyable. Um but a bad movie. Fair, fair enough. That's the best kinds of bad movies. He had a small part. Okay. I haven't seen Channing Tatum in like anything since like Magic Mike. It would have been cool in 3D. Old shoe, what am I supposed to do with that? It's like garbage. Gimme! Yes! Alright, alright, we cooked the fish for you. No. Let me go. I don't think I can talk to them. All right, I'll feed you later. It was really good in your opinion. It, um, you feel like they had a really cool concept of a bad execution. Got it. The heroine was played by the same actress who plays uh, Vill Villanelle in Killing Eve. I haven't seen that either. I'm behind on movies, you guys. I the only thing I've seen lately is Black Widow and Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Let me out. I'm still getting used to the controls. Uh I saw the new Suicide Squad. Sleep until morning. But yeah, I was I was talking the other day. My favorite movie theater is still closed. For COVID, 
Um, and I'm like, I just, I really miss it. Press L to toggle the clock and trajectory display on and off. Oh, that's cool. Wake up! Wake the fuck up! Get up! Well, I won't die just yet. Thanks, Stella. It's better that I th uh, better than I thought it could be. But again, you've always been a wonder in the kitchen. Don't forget, spirits don't run on sunshine and water. We need a good meal once in a while. It'll be up to you to understand who's fond of what. As for me, I'm sure uh, you remember I've always loved comfort food. And that I would die for a cup of coffee. No, I want coffee. But I'm not that picky. I can eat anything. Just never the same thing twice. Oh, and before I forget, here's something I was supposed to give you. I'm not exactly sure how it works, but uh, an obol is a symbol of passage. It's free. It, it's a fee each spirit has to pay you. But something tells me that you knew that already. Okay, let's keep improving this craft. You must have seen in your blueprint table that there is both a field and a garden blueprint, which means you can grow many different things. And turn the ship into an adorable farm of sorts. You should add a field first, in my opinion. It's going to be easier to find the resources for it uh, around here. You can grow linen in it. Which, in turn, can be used to craft more things. In addition to building a field, we should go buy seeds to use in it. But that will come later. I need you to visit an island close by. It's called... Moistine Cove? And there's something in it we need. I will tell you when we get there. Mostine, Mostine Cove? Untainted Wisdom. Hello, welcome in. How you doing today? Seeds for the future. Do you need something else? Are we good? Alright. Let's see. Can I build this now? No. Okay. Alright, where are we going? This looks relevant. Craters. Oh, well, that's kind of cool. What if we go to one of these first? This looks more... Let's do it. I want to go there. We're going rogue! Ah, <sighs> I'm talking so much, I'm not used to it. Oh, wait, shit! Hold up. I, I want jellyfish! Give me the jellyfish! I don't feel great. Go, I still have faith in you. I'll watch from the inside. Don't be scared, Stella. They'll be coming straight for us. Gimme! Give Gimme give the jellyfish! Yeah! Oh, I'm so good at this game. Got all of them, 100%. No, don't go high. All right, it's all right. We, we prepared for this this time. Oh, I wasn't that prepared. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. All right. All right, we missed a couple. It's fine. We can still get an A. I'm starting to think the angle grooves are, are not as good. the green one. Ah! Green! Yes. If this was the whole game, I'd be down for like two hours of this. Oh my god, there's so many! are so good you feel the same it's like 
it's like some mini games. Not all mini games, but these mini games are fun. I'm excited to get something that's like not herring or boots. I'm also curious if these events are gonna be like totally random or uh or not. As I understand the ship is powered by your Everlight. That's how it cruises the ocean and reveals the stray spirits. It also explains why I couldn't do anything by myself. Mm -hmm. You must admit, it's quite fascinating. Look, I know you must feel overwhelmed. Charon, mm -hmm. the Everdoor, the Spirit Fairs, this place, this boat, uh, me being here, it's a lot. You must be wondering what's mm -hmm. going on. Truth be told, I don't really know either, but I'm here for you. I'll do my best to help you and try to make sense mm -hmm. of it all. As I said earlier, I wanted to leave by myself, but somehow I just couldn't. Now that I see you, I think I know why. I'll give you some space for now. Don't hesitate to explore the ship. You can even give that fishing rod a try. Oh, I'm all over the fishing rod. That's how you feel playing Animal Crossing when you're trying to get all the fish. <laughs> like, can I get something other than the, like, what is it? The, the red herring or whatever it is that I, I always get the same goddamn fish. Between me and Dave, you think you're gonna play this off stream, good chill vibes? It's very chill. Like, I have the feeling that, like, this game won't get too complicated at any point, is my impression. And that's that's kind of what I want. I, I want a nice, kind of simple game. So far, I'm loving it, yeah. The world is your oyster. I do wish it had voice acting. But that's just the... the the streamer and me being lazy. So how do I- what do I do here? Oh! Oh, sick! Wait, what- what's on my boat? Oh. Oh, that's kinda cool. I don't know how to pick this one up. Ah, eh, whatever. Down, down. Whatever, just go around. Anything over this way? I like that the cat is on the ball so it won't get wet. down please oh didn't even mean to do that but it was so cute oh it won't let me get on the little boat there that's all right i think we got everything that we were supposed to get and then i guess we have to move again Has this also been filling in a map? It has. Okay. Alright, let's go here. Since we're nice and close. I am curious if, like, everything takes the same amount of time or if there's some variance. Alright, look at that seagull. How close can we get? Oh, not very. So we get some more fish. Can't have too many fish, maybe. I don't know. Mm. 
Oh yeah, so there's some games on sale right now that I've been thinking about picking up. A handful that I was looking at. And I'm thinking I'll get one more. Probably for myself just to play off stream. But uh, Spirit Fair, or not Spirit Fair, we're playing Spirit Fair. Slay the Spire is on sale on Switch. And I really like Slay the Spire. Um, and I was like, oh, this would be such a good, like, play in bed relax kind of game um and then there was also there was a game that we played uh during like our demo day that was no longer home uh that i was really intrigued by mustine cove I, I don't know how they want me to say that discover we discovered it we discovered the cove look at that hmm. We should hop on that island over there. Maybe we'll find something interesting. Now it'll let me use the boat? Yeah. Excellent. Gimme. Mostine. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's what they, they want. And that's what they're going for. Here we go. What a magic, a majestic tree. Well, you can cut it down. Yes, it's fine, I promise. It's the best way to get the wood you need, actually. But don't worry, they'll regrow over time. Another interesting fact about the Everlight. <gasps> Wait, how is the cat holding it? Oh my god, I have to do it. Oh, that's so good. Oh, it's so funny. Get out of the way, cat! Hey, nice. Dave, hello! Congratulations! For you've become the death- Become death, the destroyer of worlds. Daffodil giving 110%. Dave, thank you so much for that resub. I really appreciate it. How's Spirit Fair going? I'm loving it so far. It's what a beautiful game. Uh, for you have, uh, for you have become death, the destroyer of worlds. Jokes aside, that's how you do it. Go ahead, uh, cutting down more trees. Then we can go back to the boat and build the field with all those maple logs. I'll be next to the raft. Can we cut down like any of these, or is it just designate? Oh, what? Oh shit! Berries. How was the rest of your stream? How does this cat just like levitate? <laughs> oh, that's so funny visually. It's either the cat is like holding it in its mouth, just like, ah, or. Or, uh, the cat is being dangled by its neck. <laughs> Neither option are good. <laughs> Kingdom Hearts was Kingdom Hearts. It's funny, I'm not convinced that you actually like video games. Just dated by now. Kingdom Hearts is supposed to be classic. Yeah, the one that that uh, he was playing earlier just looked very dated. I'm sure it's a fine game. I also just like to make fun of games sometimes. You're a little hungry. Have a hug. Surprise hug. Ah. I don't like the hesitation there. The hesitation is like. All right, guess we're good to go. Yeah, I haven't played any of the Kingdom Hearts games, I don't think. I think I had a couple for the PlayStation 2, but I, I don't remember ever playing them. Or if I did, it was very little. 
Like I, I played it when like with a friend or something, maybe. I don't know. It was a long time ago. Build. Field. I need limestone? What do you mean? BRB grabbing food? Enjoy your food. It's too dark to navigate. It'll be possible again at dawn. I guess we have to go to the other location then. All right, back to bed. Oh, actually, we could make some food. So because I guess they won't eat the same food twice. I don't know if that's real or serious, but... X, X. This is a bad way to sleep. You should at least take the couch. Oh, this is pretty. I am excited for the lightning storms. I've seen them once. Once or twice from other people playing it. And it was in the demo. It was in the demo, too. I remember that was fun. Although I'm, I, I'm glad to see that there's other little mini-games. Like, there's also the jellyfish and stuff, so... I'm glad I have other things to look forward to that I haven't, like, seen at all. Poached fruit. I can't interact with you. All right. We'll wait until morning. Now we wait. Oh, you guys. So, like, I, I really like uh, berry preserves for toast. So, like, blackberry and strawberry and raspberry. But the other day, when I was up in New Hampshire, I picked up some uh, apple butter. Um, which is basically just, like, apples put into a crock pot and left there for 24 hours. Or, and they just, it just becomes, like, a cream. Um, and, oh my god, it's delicious. I got, like, the smallest one that they had. Uh, and I, I wish I had gotten, like, the largest one they had. It's so good. I used to make apple butter, um after going, like, apple picking, but I haven't done that in a while. No, sorry, Stella. You know I can't eat fruit for the life of me. I've tried, but I just can't. What? Oh, you so picky. You said you weren't picky. Please, I can't eat the same thing twice. I don't hate myself that much. Oh my god, you guys. I ate the same thing for dinner tonight as I ate last night. Like, I had leftovers. Meal prep, come on. Oh, I got that one. Well, you see. Apple butter's delicious. Apple butter with Teddy Grahams tastes just like apple pie. Oh my god, yeah. Yeah, that sounds perfect. All right, so I guess now we need to go... Ooh. We haven't gone here yet. I wonder if it'll take longer to go there than it will here. I guess we'll try that. Go to the other one next if it doesn't have what we need.
Another herring. All right, it's fine. Oh shit, 95%. You need to calm down with that bell. When you ring it at night, people will get up. Nobody likes to be woken up, especially me. Oh, I'm sorry, does this bother you? Need like a thousand more. Oh, you're right, Allie. We're very close. Coffee beans, linen seeds. I can't help but notice that that's not the only resource that I need to make this thing. Ooh, what's that? What's that? What's that? What's that? Press and B to dive? Whoa! Copper ore? Oh shit, okay. Oh, also, regarding the community challenge, this is funny. So I've been trying to think of, like, how I'm going to set up my camera so that you guys can, like, see me actually do my makeup and have it not, like, look terrible. Um, and I was kind of looking around to see, like, what cameras other streamers use. And I was like, eh, maybe I'll upgrade my camera. I'm probably not going to. I'll just, like, use the one on my laptop because that one's actually a better camera. Uh, and... Um... I checked, like, a, a professional streamer's list of gear that they had, and the camera that they listed was, like, a $1,000 camera. I was like, oh my god. Like, just, what's crazy to me about that is that your face is shrunken down to, like, a two-inch square on someone's phone. Like... <laughs> <laughs> that, I can't imagine that 4K goes very far, you know? But, like, it's quality. No lie about that. Uh, I suppose we'll go down to this one, huh? Uh, don't ask me how, but I've met Albert already. He definitely is a shark. But his interest in all things maritime will be helpful, such as the boat upgrades he sells at an outrageously high price. With those, you'll be able to cross ominous weather barriers in the world. Uh, they look like classical, mythical challenges again. A bit cliche, if you ask me. I bet I'm gonna have to, like, upgrade the fishing rod to catch more interesting fish. I just, I, I just want to make them upset about the bell again. That's how I'm going to wake them every day. 100%. Oh, I didn't mean to fall. And let me tell you, they were complaining about this guest room, but this is, like, nicer than my guest room. My guest room just being the floor. The guest floor. Yeah, or if I really like you, I'll, like... I don't know, set up a couch or like an air mattress or something, you know. Limestone, I just... What's that mean, track? Guest air. <laughs> Yes, Allie, you're very special. <laughs> oh, 
We made it, we made it, we made it. All right, it's down in this. That gets an ore. I left the door cracked so that the cats could come in and they're just not doing it. All right, all this stuff seems great, but none of it is what I need. Limestone! All right, we got one limestone out of three. All right, we're gonna have to move again. All right. Oh, the poor cat is just terrorized by the water. Poor thing. All right, off we go again. Uh, da, 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 da. uh, gonna be lurking because you realize it's the last day to catch all the August fish and pugs in Animal Crossing. Yeah, no worries at all. Enjoy, uh, enjoy your, your bug, bug catching in Animal Crossing. I'm like, I, I just cheat in that game so bad. Um, you know, actually, let's go back to the shipyard because it's right here and I've got money to spend. Um, I just changed the date on my Switch, the date and time all, like, anytime I play Animal Crossing now. I'm like, oh, I missed like a whole month of events or whatever. I'll just go back a month. It works for some things and not others, but I don't know. I've I've been told that that's like not, not like, not a good way to play. But also, it's my it's my game, and I'll play how I want. You don't want to risk losing your people because you're gone too long. Does that happen? I don't think that they can just leave, right? Like, you you have to approve them leaving, I think. I might be wrong. But I've, like, I've never had a villager actually leave. I've had them, like, ask to leave. You only ever go back, like, a week. Got it. Yeah, I, I always thought that, like, once they're in your party, they're, like, permanently there. So, like, if you go back a week at when you had a different villager, that other villager won't be there anymore. Yeah, no, like, definitely don't, don't do it if you're, if you're nervous about it, for sure. Who are you? Hello? Oh, please. All right. Hello there, young lady. I guess you must be the new spirit fairer. I'm happy to make your acquaintance. I'm Francis. You can say I'm a sort of wandering merchant. See, I'm very fond of things. Objects, curios, tchotchkes. I just buy everything. Simply put, I will buy anything you don't want anymore. I'm sure you've come across a few valuable treasures already. So tell me, what is it you want to part with? In older games, they can just up and go, so you gotta stay aware. Oh god, that's so scary. Oh my gosh. Uh, buy? Odd seed. 500 gleams. That's too much. Old shoe. I don't know what to do with this stuff. I feel like I might need stuff. I don't know what I don't need yet. Errands. I'm immensely chipper to see a dynamic young lady being so hard at work. Not that Charon wasn't a true professional, but his manners were, well, a bit cold, if you know what I mean. He kept everything he found. What a pity. But you're here now. Huzzah, if I dare say. Oh, and don't feel... Uh, don't fret, uh, budding merrier. If I ever... If ever needed, old Francis will never be too far. But don't let me an independent... Let me be an independent to your appetite for adventure. Go on, set sail, little blue jet. Uh... I think we're done here.
Can I not talk to the shark? Do I have to take the, uh, the smaller boat, maybe? Aha, Stella! I've been getting your mail here for the past month. I'm not a post office. You need to add a mailbox to your boat. If I get one more letter filled with glitter, I'll lose it. I'm warning you. You might be a customer, but I deserve the right to yell at you. Get it done. Rude. I once had a friend who cut his own toe. He had, he had a new one made of rubber. He was called Roberto. What? I can't even buy the mailbox? I feel like I'm supposed to be able to buy... some stuff and I can't. Like, I, I almost don't want to use this limestone because I know I need it to make the... the, uh... the, the field, and that's, like, more of my quest right now, so I guess I'm not gonna do this. That kind of... that kind of stinks, but that's alright. It's fine, it's fine, everything's fine, it's good. Press this. Yeah, I still have to just build a field. Alright, well. Let's see. Oh! Oh, that's kind of cool. I can just go to him, I guess. I still need ore. Course. We're gonna have to wait for the boat anyways, but I do think it's funny that it's too dark to navigate, but ships usually use like stars to navigate. Good morning. You know, I'm delighted that you're here with me, but I'm not surprised one bit. It adds up. You here taking care of me in my final hours. You've always cared so damn much about others. Always protect those you found vulnerable. Even... pedantic snobs like me. Remember the day my father yelled at the cat? Mm -hmm. We just got out of elementary school. You were wearing those blue sneakers with the glittery, glittery tags. And there you were, yelling back at your father like you were on a mission. Mm -hmm. Father turned red and smashed the purple... Delano vase. It was rad. practicing our parkour for next time we get jellyfish. Beautiful. Ten points. Quick! 
I just couldn't explain it at first, but then it hit me. I'm starving. I know you're hungry. I'm trying. I tried to give you so much food and you just didn't want it. There's two, there's two. All right, we just need like one more. Yeah, all right, is that enough? Did we do it? I don't know what to do with the vibrant necklace either. So I'll probably give it to someone, I guess. I think I'm... Did something move? I feel like something was like shaking the boat. I think I'm also getting the idea that like, as soon as you're done somewhere, you should start moving to the next location. Just to not have to stand around too much when you have stuff to do. So like now I can go and build. Oh my God, it's so big though. All right. Into it. I'm into it. Mm -hmm. All right. A field. I've done it. Hummingbird discovered. I like that name. Makes me think of birds. Ah, it's better looking than I thought. There's a little genie size quo to it. Simple but elegant. They even spelled it out for me and I'm like, what? Now all you have to do is plant field seeds in there. Fields can grow, seeds can grow only in their respective places. Garden seeds won't grow in the field, so don't mm. bother trying. But you know me, I would kill a plastic cactus, so don't take my word on this. Anyway, there's only one place where we could possibly find what we need. Theodore specializes in seeds. He has set up a shop in Hummingburg, the busiest town of the area. Theodore and his brothers. I'm, we're already here. Founders of Raccoon Inc. and shady retail franchise with very loose moral values. I like that they're raccoons. Janne Sewa. Sequa. Oh, that makes more sense. Thank you, Allie. <laughs> yes, this world's a serious uh, problem of dubious business practices. Since I don't want to get all swindled, I'll come with you and do most of the talking. Sure, you will. Mm -hmm. I've run this cheeky little raccoon once, and his dishonesty was blatant. Let's head to Hummingburg, then. We just need to find some seeds for that field. I have so many seeds. Daffodil's just playing with his Everlight, yeah. Uh, I feel like linen is gonna be more useful. Oh, hell yeah, I can water him. We did it! All right, we're here. Let's buy some seeds. Theodora has set up shop on this island. Let's pay him a visit. You got it. Y'all, this is such a lovely game. It's so pretty. Hmm. 
I'm out here looking for the right house to start a family. My wife sent me out to find something that might fit our needs. A garden, maybe a pool. I'm not asking for much, I just can't decide. I know that you can't help me, but it helps to say it out loud. I might stumble on the rarest of finds. Good luck, buddy. Yeah, I hope my next game will be ready soon. I've crunched the data and spent five nights theory crafting. Clearly, if you take the heavy weapon proficiency from the mountain gnome race, there's a nifty synergy with that level 3 rogue ability... Eviscrate. It's for sure a bit weird, but hey. <laughs> 5d20 and auto crit on prone can't be defeated, am I right? We found the D&D &D dev. There's like one dev that's like super into D&D &D and was like, please, for the love of God, just let me do one line of dialogue. And they were like, one. You get one. <laughs> oh, let me guess. A bit of a psychic, you know. Your name is Mary. Marguerite. Missy. No, wait. Don't tell me. It's... Oh, shoot. I'll get it. Someday. <laughs> I should do that. I should just start making up names for people. I don't see how it could ever go wrong. Oh, this was in the demo, too, I'm realizing. Yeah, I remember you could, like, go into the buildings and get stuff. I like that it auto-picks everything up, too. Stella's face. I need to watch the faces more, because I keep, like, just reading the text, and then I kind of miss what's mm. going on. Take a look at this shrine, Stella. It's simply stunning. Some objects in this world are meant to resonate with the spirit bear and the mm. Everlight. I've heard this monument has power to enhance the Everlight's abilities. Mm. The two slots on it need to be filled up. I'm fairly certain you could use, uh... uh Obbles to activate it, but you only get obbles you need to welcome more spirits mm -hmm. on your ship. I'm sure you'll find more lost souls like me. All right. Interesting. Eh. Let me up. I simply adore your hat. Our local shop, uh, Raccoon Inc., only carries garbage wares. Seeds, logs, rocks, all useless items. I need me a hat like yours. Okay, alright, but how do I get up here? Game. I want to go up the chimney. can't climb on this. How do I get up there? Okay. I'm going home. Don't follow me, please. I hate it when people know where I live. But if you know my address, you'll tell people. Then they'll tell people. Listen, just... I just don't want junk mail. Stop it. This is wrong. Leave me alone. <laughs> Oh, I feel bad now! <laughs> sir, sir, please, just tell me how to get up here. Yes? Oh, I thought you had something to say. <laughs> Be gone, stranger. <laughs> Can I step on the door now? That'd be funny. Stop rattling my knob! Leave my door alone! <laughs> How far does this go? Well, we'll be back. We'll be back. We're gonna terrorize this guy some more. I'm sorry, I'm in a bit of a rush. Good. What? Come on. There's Theodore. Go ahead, take a look what he's selling. Mm -hmm. 
what? A key to the city. Linen seed, corn seed, carrot seed, limestone. Oh my god, so expensive. Oh my god, copper, so expensive. So I have carrot seeds, linen, coffee, and turnip. I don't have corn. Oh, and I can't afford it anyways. All right. Those prices are out of control. I won't let him get away with this. Are you ready to see me deliberate with this merchant? Sure. Good, let's do this. Theodore! I know what you're doing here, and you should be ashamed of yourself, you trash panda. People like you are the reason we have middle fingers. Whoa, all right. What? Madam, what's the meaning of this? My friend here is the new spirit fairer, but she's not a newbie, and neither am I. That little scam of yours won't work on us. But I, I can assure you my business practices are quite above board. Be warned, you treacherous striped weasel. I won't tolerate this behavior one more second. No more shenanigans, no more double crosses, just fair prices. I- I- Stop being dishonest at once. The next time I see you, I'll try being nicer. If you start being smarter. Got it? But... Yes. Yes, of course. I promise you I'll adjust my prices. I beg you, please don't scold me anymore. I'll even give you a discount. Hey, you. Yes, you. Your friend really gave that greedy merchant some hell. You both look like you could possibly join the upstairs crew. You want to come up, don't you? I can see it in your eyes. I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty cool being up here. Yeah, all the best people are up here. Don't get too excited, though. Some idiot broke the ladder. You'd have to be able to jump to inhumanely, inhumanly high to make it. I guess you could also use the stairs in that house. But some other idiot lost the key. Anyway, see ya! Upstairs crew forever! <laughs> Step right up, potential prospect. Picking up pup. Have a good walk. Welcome to Raccoon Inc. We've been servicing hummingbirds since forever. You've got the gleams, I've got the goods. I've got all the wares to make you spend those hard-earned gleams. Step right up. Uh, didn't I need this for something else? Maybe I should buy some. I'm just gonna buy three. Why not? Fantastic! Mm -hmm. If you got everything you need, I'll take my leave. Feel free to stay here as long as you want. I'll meet you at the pier. We got some corn. We can't afford the key, so we're not gonna buy it. All right, let's go check on this door. I guess I'm gonna get double jump at some point and then I'll be able to go up there. to go back. Can you over water in this game? it it was on so it was some some group that i was in um some plant related group where it's like about succulents specifically how to take care of succulents because i've got a couple over here um and they're mostly alive 
mostly. Uh, but there was a really funny post that someone made a while ago that they um, had been watering this plant that looks like one of these. Looks like one of the, one of these. And they had been watering it for like a year or two and it hadn't grown at all, but like they don't grow very much. It's a very just small cactus. And um, at one point it got like knocked over and it fell out of the pot. And it turns out it was actually just a plastic plant in a pot. <laughs> and I was like, you know what? Maybe I should get some plastic plants. Looks great. Way ahead of me, Stella. Your thumb is as green as your hat. This boat will soon become a cozy floating farm. Don't forget, you'll probably have to water the plants once in a while. Don't ask my word for it, though. My gardening knowledge is limited as my father's empathy. You'll have to find better mentors than me. Which reminds me, I believe it's time for you to find new people. Not that I don't love the idea of just the two of us cruising the ocean, but you are a spirit fairer. And spirit fairers find spirits. And yes, help them fulfill their last wishes. Remember, uh, or however mundane they can be. I've heard of a place not far from here where someone might be in need of your help. And I'll bet you'll like this one if he is who I think he is. Go, set sail. Where are we going? Oh. But we can't go here until we upgrade. I don't think. Right? We're gonna find out. I have a feeling that we're gonna have to upgrade. But we'll give it a try. I can't think of anything else but food right now. I'm sorry, you don't eat anything that I have. Can I just give you berries? Mm. A little variety. Oh my god, you're gonna die. You're gonna die. Are we gonna make it through the storm? Are we gonna be alright? We need lightning. Oh, maybe we'll get lightning now, though? <laughs> or maybe not. Barkenshim Creek discovered. Bronox, hello. Welcome in. Oh, we've been here before. This looks familiar. Because we cut down the tree. Go, cat, go! Good cat. Good job. This game looks cute. This game is so cute. Oh my god. This game is adorable. It's like just what I was in the mood for. I like I wasn't sure what to play today. I knew I wanted to stream, but I didn't know what. And uh, I've been wanting to play this game for a long time. Ever since I played the demo, I've been really interested in it. But, like, I missed getting it on sale at one point, and was like, ah, alright, I guess I'll just wait for the next sale. And then it just, like, didn't go on sale for, like, two months. <laughs> so, I, um, just coincidentally today, it went on sale. So, if you want to pick up this game, it's 50% off right now. You've been interested in it too, but never pulled the trigger. Yeah, for me, it takes a decent sale for me to be like, all right, fine, I'll get it. <laughs> Unless it's like a game that I'm like highly, highly anticipating, I almost always wait for a sale. 
Which is coincidentally the question of the day. You're here, listen. I dropped a lemon in that pond. My fingers were all sticky. It just sort of slipped. Why? Good question. I've been eating delicious berries all day. Look at my hands, I swear. I've been experimenting. I went, wanted to squeeze a little bit of the citrus on these wild fruit. Now it's just berries with no twist. Useless. It's just down there, in the water. I'll do it myself, but I have these clumpy fruits to take care of. Uh, this game gives you Stardew feels, but it's a different gameplay. Yeah, I um, I, I want to check out uh, Stardew. That one's also on my list. It's a little bit more farming, I think, right? Or this is a little bit more, like, base buildy. I just need a tissue or something. I don't want to get berry juice all over it. Never mind. Just hold on to that lemon for me. Don't go and squeeze it. Wait a minute. Maybe you could help me? This island is fresh out of food. My stomach always feels empty. Maybe I could help out aboard your ship with cooking, fishing, and building. I don't have any spices. I don't have my spices and tools, but I'll make it work. Don't think about it so much. Let's just go get on your boat. We did it. We got another boat friend. Is this base building or boat building? <laughs> yeah. Stardew is totally farming. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. More time management aspects. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, I guess because there's like daytime and nighttime and only certain actions you can do at certain times. Stella! Oh, wow. This boat is amazing. Here comes the real kicker, you little rascal. Get ready for a family reunion. Frog! It's me, Stella, your uncle, Atul. Surprised? Happily, I suppose. I've been on that island for a while now. I can't wait to see the sights, the sea with you. It was lonely with my thoughts. Now I got you, Sprout. Let's set sail for a great adventure. Onwards. Wait a second. Is that a... Uh, where are you going? I knew it! That's a Seamaster 2000! It seems like a lot of fun getting to know the villagers. Yeah, you can hug them and stuff, too. Um, I've actually never seen it in action. I've only heard the rumors. Apparently you can catch the biggest and brightest fish out there. Uh, so far, it's only been herring, so there better be a bunny. <laughs> wow, Stella, you sure know how to treat yourself. Wait a darn second. You're missing a few bolts. Let me guess. You've been fishing out mostly garbage. Well, not anymore. Thank you. Thank you. I knew that there was an upgrade that came with the with the fish. You'll see a difference immediately. Give it a go for a fan. Oh, I fucked up. squid your job I never stood a chance you sure don't mess around I hope there, there's like a parrot a parrot person that comes aboard the ship that's what I want that's what makes you a pro all this ace level fishing has gotten me all rattled up which reminds me I had this shiny thing in my pockets on the island I have no idea what it does maybe you can hold on to it for safekeeping I suppose oh brother I need to take a breather oh and by the way you might be curious and might have already tried, but yes, the water is very salty. Well, I'll go and take a look around. You can fish your to your heart's content if you want. Cool. Uh, I guess you're not hungry, so I won't feed you. I was gonna feed you. Are these not done? 
Ah, this one is. Ah! Oh, extra water. Let's do corn. We've got two ovals. Remember that shrine in Hummingbird? I'd try to add them there. If we're lucky, we might get... I might do something amazing. If not, you'll have wasted your time. You should go see. At least they're up front, that like, you might waste your time. Can I cook the coffee beans? Will it make coffee? We're gonna find out. That was very quick. Ha! Ah! Coffee! Where'd you go? Yeah, I know. Now this is one damn fine cup of coffee. I might have to go get coffee if they keep talking about coffee. Mm -hmm. This is certainly my favorite of them all. Thank you very much, Stella. Oh, good. Why are you eating a cake? I gave you coffee. You make your coffee in the oven, too! <laughs> no, no, let me out. Oh boy! I love food! Keep them coming! Can't get enough of it! We haven't hugged him yet. Aww. I love watching the cat. Just the cat rolling around. Wasn't that great favorite niece of mine? That was cute. That was sweet. Alright, well we gotta move. We gotta move. Can't sit anywhere for too long. Um, they did want us to go back here. Let's... I want to go back through the storm again, because I just, like, I think that's how we're going to be able to get the lightning in a bottle, but I could be wrong. That just makes sense. Oh, you guys, I want cake now, too. I might, after stream, have to make some of that, uh... Have you, have you ever done, like, the brownie in a mug? I have this good recipe for, uh, for one. And it just hits the spot. Hey, thank you so much for those hundred bits! Seamus, have a good night. Time to eat, we'll be lurking. I appreciate the lurk. Take it easy. Stella, quick, come here. This is what I call a storm. Oh, I was right. I was right, you guys. Any respectable person would never let their friends get hit by lightning. Yeah, Ronox. So it's like, uh, it's, it's, you make your own brownie mix. Um, but it's just like flour, sugar, and cocoa powder, basically. And you just mix it together with, uh, milk and oil and just put it in the microwave for like a minute. And it, it's just like one serving, and it's perfect. It's a very college student, but I, it hits the spot. Um, when I have more time, I, I like to make really decorative cupcakes, really fancy cupcakes, but they, they take a couple hours. Uh, any respectable person would never let their friend get hit by lightning, but I think you should try. You have the Everlight. It will protect you. Lightning bolts cast sparks where they're about to hit. Uh, rush towards those. Ah, I almost forgot. Have you got any empty bottles? If you're hit by lightning uh, with an empty bottle, you get lightning in a bottle. Isn't that bananas? This world. Lightnings and bottles are a very handy resource, so come here equipped. As a head start, here are a few bottles for you. But don't worry, they're pretty easy to come by. Get ready for the thrill of your life. Alright, let me know if the uh, the audio gets too loud here. Oh, shit. Oh, cool. So I just have to, like, stand on it. Oh, I missed it. 
Oh, did you see the cat get hit by lightning? gave me money in real life. God, that's fun. <laughs> that was really cool. Oh shit, we did it. We hit the challenge. Dave, thank you for pushing us over the challenge. And it wasn't too loud? Okay, cool. Sounds awesome. I wish I knew that when you were in college. I'll, I'll post the recipe in the Discord if you're interested. It's very easy. It's it like, it literally takes 30 seconds and I, I just like, I add in some extra chocolate chips on top because I just love chocolate. All right, well, at some point, probably next weekend, this coming weekend, we'll do a makeup stream. Get ready with me. Oh, thank goodness. I wasn't sure if you were going to make it there for a second. You gave your old uncle quite a scare. Did you feel that rumble? What a rush. You look pretty awesome catching those jolts of lightning all over the boat. Thanks for being the best captain I could ever have hoped for. Aw. Dave coming in clutch. Uh, well, it's nighttime now, so. Frog boy. Oh. Yeah, it's kind of like bittersweet whenever there's a character that you like, because you know you're just gonna like deliver them to their death, right? Wake up! Oh, finally. Very bittersweet. Yeah, it's gonna be sad when it, when it finally happens. Make some more coffee and some more linen. Super wholesome, but it has dark undertones too, for sure. Yeah, it makes sense. I'm into it, though. Like, I, I was kind of looking forward to a kind of somber game. Oh, we're close. Okay. Good morning. Um, there's some materials that we need in order to, like, make a garden and stuff. Um... Oh, we have it. Oh, we can make it now. Oh, shit. All right. Well, we'll do that once we're done here so that we can start traveling to the next place because now I'm thinking efficiently. We're here. We're going to do what we need and then we're going to go and then we're going to build stuff at night. Oh, uh, now I definitely am going to make some sort of baked good tonight. Um, my favorite go-to, like, the, the what I usually bake is a red velvet cupcake. Um, you know what? We, we want to do this first. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I've terrorized you. I didn't even read that. I just said yes. We're acquiring something. It better be double jump. Spring feet. Oh, yeah. Heck yeah. Nice. Top tier jump. Oh, we're in the we're in the upstairs club. What can moves getting up here? I kind of lied earlier. It's not so great up here, but you're here, so it might get better. I don't have a membership card for you. 
You'll be an honorary member of the upstairs crew. I'll show you the secret handshake, but I don't know where your hands have been. <laughs> upstairs crew forever! Oh, locked. Alright. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Wait, is that a sheep? Ah. My sister keeps asking me for money. How can I say no without saying no? Maybe I should ask someone to rob me. Hmm. I just don't want to loan my sister money anymore. <laughs> That's a very, uh, roundabout solution. What? Oh! You gave me such a fright. That cat. He looks familiar. Daffodil? Is that you? Oh yes, yes it is. Ever so silky, aren't you? Then that must mean... Stella, is that really you? What a fantastic turn of events. Is that boat over there at sea? You came to rescue me again, I see. Well, not so fast. This time, I'll be the one doing the teaching. You can't beat me on it. Let's get going, then. We have some lessons to go through. <laughs> Upstairs crew for life. Alright, what's over here? They would not let me go this far without there being something, right? Lies and deceit. Game, please. Yeah, right? They can't just have some little path off to the side and then not let me take advantage of it. Alright, will you eat this now? Thanks, I love it. Oh, good, alright. They just won't eat the same thing in a row. You're Stella, if I recall correctly. I'll never forget the face, especially if they have shiny gleams. Don't be shy, have a look. Um, I think it was corn that I got before. I'm gonna grab a couple more corn. I don't think I need anything else. And then we got that one, yeah. Oh, I feel so much better having both double jump. I wasn't expecting to get another boat passenger so quickly, though. Alright, first thing we gotta do is travel anywhere else. Oh, it won't let me. Alright. Over here, your little one. Oh, Stella, all this air, all this open space. Yes, I feel I can grow quite nicely here. Look at me, I'm a flowering already. What is it? Oh, it's a snake. I've seen the snake before. Oh, getting out of this. Clarisils, what a feeling. Snick. Thank you, Stella. The more, the merrier. Hey. Alright, so we gotta move somewhere else and then we gotta rearrange the whole boat. Uh, here. There's so much stuff around. All the passengers are super cool. I get that impression for sure.
Okay, so we're gonna need to upgrade our ship, like, immediately is what I'm getting the impression of. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love that I can move stuff under. But that still won't work. Okay. Alright. We're gonna start to get a little bit less efficient for a minute. But then I'm gonna get more space and we're gonna make it work. Eh, yeah, that's fine. I'm excited to see Dave and I build our boats. Yeah, I'm excited to have the boat like fully built out. Like that's, I honestly, I was just thinking, I'm like, it's been two hours and I wasn't planning on streaming much longer than that tonight, but I just like don't want to stop playing. Um, Look at little silly old me. I was just about to get, uh, about to reprimand you for the lack of greenery on your boat, but lo and behold, you already put together a wonderful little garden. Yes. I feel you'll be an excellent student, Stella. Well, that that makes uh, that makes us just about ready to start on the first lesson. Make sure there are some seeds in these plots; they'll be important. Let's see now. Uh, for our first lesson, we'll start with something I've been quite excited to share. This world has some strange rules you'll probably have noticed already. I've already been the preacher. For you see, a garden is a vessel of our love. A mirror we hold ourselves, hold to ourselves. This seems truer now than ever. Back on my island, when I was lonely, I sang to the flowers. And as I expected, they grew much more vigorously. Through trial and error, I've managed to write a little song. The plants seem to react particularly well to it. I want, I want to further test that observation with you. Go inside the garden and try playing a piece, try paying that piece to your crops. What, I have to sing to the crops? What? I am hitting X. Shit, what? Oh god. B. A. A. B. Fuck. I don't know the switch controls very well. A. A. X. Quite incredible. Have you seen how the plants swayed and grew as you entertained them? Isn't that fabulous? Guitar hero time. Oh no. <laughs> I suspect emotions in this world manifest themselves much more vividly. Well, I'll make sure to spread the word about this fascinating discovery. And who knows? Other passengers might know how to play some music too. They might help if it, in a good enough mood. Famous Daffodil is lead vocals, oh my god. Speaking of which, in all commotion of the last few days, I forgot something. Here, this is for you. A strange token has been tickling me since I arrived here. I'm relieved it's not one of those pollen allergies again. Alright, let's, let's try this again. Oh my god, the cat really does sing.
The longer you do it, the more, like, layers it adds. This is so cute. <laughs> that was so cute though. Oh, Nine, have a good lurk. Eating some Chinese food, enjoy. That sounds so good. Everyone's talking to me. Oh my God, there's so many people now. Over here, what do you want? If you have any clutter, I'm always interested. Maybe we could even trade. You give your useless objects, I'll give you mine. Just the thought of new curios makes my head spin. Nearly organized my stock in, errand in errands. Take a look for yourself. Oh, cool. Uh, okay. I don't have any of that stuff. Odd seed. How much is it? 500? No way. You did good! Now we've got a real boat going. And you'll have to take care of these new passengers now. They'll be the ones testing your patience, not me. But before all that, I have something to ask you. You might have noticed by now, but sleeping in the guest house is not the ideal scenario for any of us, especially since it gets crowded in there. Look, I'm not complaining, you know. I've been terrific up to this point. You've been terrific up to this point, and it would be terribly rude for me to blame you for anything. But I think it's time for me to have my own space. Uh, a nice little house, un unpretentious but sophisticated with a cozy vibe. A space in which I could read and unwind far from the turmoil of the deck. Hmm. Oddly enough... I'd see something with an alpine flare. See, even I can be filled with nostalgia sometimes. Again, I won't be pushy on this, but I'd be delighted if you could build it for me. All right. Sure, I can do that, Gwen. Give me your money. The boat just stopped. Is it still going to load in the... Uh... Oh, great. Jellyfish are here again. Remember, you just have to crash into them to make the light burst out. You won't get hurt. Alright. Yes. That's why we're here. I picked this intentionally. Oh, I see them coming in at the top. Oh, shit. How are you supposed to get up there? What? Bullshit. Man, these ones are much quicker. I think we've done it. Sleep till morning.
Here we go. You're all wanting to talk to me. Where are we? Was there anything here? I think it was just, uh... Mushrooms. In which case, let's just go over here. Stella, I didn't want to disturb you with this, but for the last several weeks I've been having strange dreams. They were of a giant snake and menacing reefs and rotten fruit. Since you're, uh, since joining you and your crew, well, they've been much clearer. I think it's the air of the sea, or maybe the mystical energies of the Everlight. Anyway, I'm now convinced my dreams have been visions. And furthermore, I think they might be coming from our mutual acquaintance. I've been looking at the map in your cabin, and my eyes keep being drawn to a specific spot that I marked. I think we should visit. No point in making it wait. We'll get there. We'll get there. Jeez, you gotta love the sights here. The sea, the sun, the breeze, my skin feels just so right. I'm happy to be aboard the ship. With you, my niece. I wish your Aunt Vive could see you right now, running your own ship. Helping out these stranded souls... It really warms the heart. I'm glad you picked me up on that island. I'll try to make myself uh, the least cumbersome passenger on this boat. Except for food. I'll never stop asking for delicious meals. Are you hungry? I guess I should cook something. A tool's a mood. Yeah, I like... man. I wasn't hungry, and this game made me hungry. I like ate dinner specifically before streaming. Like, I always try to have a good meal before I stream so that I'll be, like, content to stream for a while. And I'm just like, where are snacks? Give me snacks. A scallop? That's exciting. What are you so unhappy about? Hungry. Needs a home. <laughs> Alright, well, let me cook something. Can I combine stuff? Does that work? No? Recipes. Hey. Got that weird feeling. I'm actually rather hungry. Mm. Oh, thank you, Stella. I love comfort mm. food so damn much. Is it always cake? Quick, jump in the water! There's a wreckage! I'm sure you'll find some useful materials there. Alright, let's see. How do I make your... Your fancy house? Oh, I've got everything I need. But I'm out of space? Oh, I'm not. Oh, glorious. Alright. Excellent. Alright. We need to go upgrade our boat, though. Uh, so let's, let's go back to... What's his name? Down here. 
one specific thing per character. Interesting. Oh, I'm gonna burn down the boat. Dave, can you combine things? Like, can I combine meat and veg? Or maybe, like, not yet. This cabin is outstanding. You get recipes, okay. It really does wonders to have a place of your own. Doesn't it remind you of my old condo, Wave Wavely? Probably the only place where I could get some peace and quiet. Thank you, old friend. Yeah, that's cute. Gotta put some furniture in there, though. Is that you? Took like your blueprint station. It's nice, I suppose. But you know what would make it even greater? More plans! Bigger buildings! I'm just saying. I'm sure Albert... Hey, that's where we're going! You guys, I'm ahead of the game. I know what it wants. We're, we're going there now. Just do wait, sir. Alright, so we definitely need a little snack. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Stella, don't you remember I don't eat any animal product? No breast milk, no ova. Certainly, they're not meant for our consumption. And the meat? No, no. Sorry, I won't impose my choices on others, but I won't eat that. I wonder if I have to, like, approve... Uh... Yeah, I'm up for it. Do I have to, like, approve every time the jellyfish come? I guess because then you can skip it if you don't want to do the minigame. Why would you ever want to skip it? Don't know if I can do them yet. Okay, got it. Yeah. That was kind of my hunch was that, like, I'll get them. Why are you so high up? Please come back. here. Get me! Get me! We got it, we got it, we got it. <laughs> Dave. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dave. I got you your food. Thank you, I was quite hungry. Oh, you're very hungry. Service on the ship is incredible!
It's a big fish. Or it's going to be a boot and the game is trolling us. new at least. I heard they just fired an employee at the popcorn factory. He was a good worker, but they found him sleeping on the cob. is raiding with a party of seven oh, thank you so much for the raid we were we just heard a terrible pun that's why i'm like oh my god <laughs> but thank you so much for the raid how was your stream what were you playing you were playing spirit fair hell yeah how are you liking it hey, dave and ali thank you for getting those shout outs appreciate it How much? Oh, I, I'm so close to having enough for this, but I don't. Oh, uh, okay. This guy and his puns, it, they're too much for me. They're too much. <laughs> I like, I've been tempted to put like a pun counter on my stream, just like for puns in general. Like not even specifically this game, but just because I, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. It's one of your favorite games? Awesome. Yeah, I just started it today. It's This is my first playthrough, so I've been uh, been just getting into it, and I love it so far. It's, it's such a... It's like exactly the game that I wanted. I wanted something like chill and relaxing, uh, but also has good emotion to it. Like, there's a really good story here. <laughs> but pun jar. <laughs> I don't have anything to do. I've got the surplus of energy. I need to get my hands busy. Can you do me a solid? You've always been my favorite niece. You know that. I think I need a place to focus that energy. In a sawmill. Yeah. You're just missing some key components. Materials. Which I'm sure you can find on nearby islands. I'm counting on you to help out. I'm sure you don't want your old uncle to sleep on the deck. Right? Alright. So I think that we, we need to get a little bit of money first. Because I want to... Um... Uh, uh, I want to expand the ship, and we're, like, less than a hundred away from what we need to do that. Well, I guess we're planting a bunch of carrots. Excited. Really love, uh, really love the game. Awesome. Yeah, I... I always, like, whenever people tell me that a game is, like, their favorite game, it always puts it on my radar. No matter what the game is, whether it's something that I think I'll like or something I don't, um, I'm always much more interested in checking it out. I just heard the cat again. Quartz dragon. I don't know what that is, but... Let's see. I guess we'll just go here to just get the gleams that we need, and then we'll come right back. Let's make some food. I'm still getting used to the, the switch controls a little bit, but...
Also, this is like a small thing, but I really like that I just use the same use button for everything. I just hit A. That That's so easy. Or like sometimes if you're just in the right place at the right time, you don't need to, to do anything. Oh, it's nighttime now. Let's sleep. Mechanics are crazy simple. It works very well. Yeah, I don't like super over complicated games. Um, like it's nice to, when you can execute something and feel really good about executing it perfectly. But I'm not always in the mood for that, you know? We're gonna have to make some vegetarian stuff for the snake. Oh, is it not done yet? Oh no. Oh no, did I fuck up? I fucked up! Whoopsie daisies. Alright, well... I wanted to make some, uh... Some of this anyways. Same here, it was nice that this game isn't... Puzzles. Um, I feel like a ton of chiller games are based around puzzles. Yeah, definitely. A lot of indie games rely on puzzle mechanics. Um, which, like, is fun sometimes. But if you're just, like, not in the mood to work, like... <laughs> Um, I was thinking about picking up Super Liminal, though. I have been really curious about that game, but that's, like, definitely, like, puzzle game, so I have to be in the right mood for it. But it's on sale on Steam right now, and I'm like, maybe it's time. Oh, I don't know if I woke anybody up. Get up! Wake, the wake up! Oh, I did it again! No! Ah, uh, shit. Okay, all right. Take three. I should make more than one at a time. I don't know why I'm just doing them one at a time. I don't have a good reason. Good. Glad you enjoyed. Jellyfish. All right. Oh, that's right. We have to approve the jellyfish. Been thinking about father recently. When he left with Doug, I didn't feel anything. No sorrow, no hate, no relief, nothing. I didn't it didn't really matter to me. But it mentioned it mattered to you. You spent three days crying in Aunt Petunia's room. I thought you three sister I brought you the three sisters, um, and gave you that damn oversized sweater I had knitted a month prior. Mum was appalled, but you felt better. Um I long wondered why you were so sad, and best I could come up with was that you were sad in my stead. Mm -hmm. Feeling things I couldn't feel myself. Mm -hmm. Here they come again. Oh, I don't feel great. Go on, I have faith in you. Mm -hmm. Alright, jellyfish begin! I like the jellyfish. Oh, they, like, move around. They don't, like, stay in a straight path. I didn't realize that. The music gets so intense. Come back! Jellies, please! Heading out for dinner. Hoping to have an awesome time with the stream. Nice meeting you. Thank you so much for that raid! Everybody, if you haven't already, please uh, jump over and give Lizzie a follow. I appreciate it a lot. Have a great dinner.
Chris Dragon have a oh oh no sorry you're saying hello <laughs> I saw good night and so I was like oh good night <laughs> I'm like mostly trying to not miss all of these jellyfish gimme luckily we have enough to expand the boat now Yeah, the music is is fantastic. No question. All right, let's try cooking five of these at once. All right. That one's so fast, but I'm going to come back anyways. All right, so we made it here. Let's go back here. Give me all of these. Yeah, popcorn. Will you eat popcorn? Aha, perfect. Yeah, I love the nice chill vibes. It's just, it's really just like what I needed in the game right now. What? Seems to be quite a few faces aboard. I like it, don't get me wrong. Uh, I just don't want you to forget Uncle Atul. You know me, I'm Mr. Personality. I can get along with anyone, anywhere, anytime. I just didn't think I'd have to make it, have to make new friends at my age. You don't have to worry. I'll be all right. Sorry, I even brought it up. I'll just stand at the edge of the boat and take uh, the Splendor, you know? Hopefully no bugs will fly in my mouth. That's no fun. What? You're a frog! That's what you want! What? It was in your head all day at work. But also, I should say a proper welcome into the stream, Chris. Happy to have you here. to get some more variety of seeds soon. Half here because you're cooking dinner. That seems to be the theme. Everybody is making food. But that's like my favorite time of day. I'm always so happy to make and then eat dinner. I don't know. I, I like cooking a lot. Recently, I've been trying to like experiment with making different types of meals. Uh, so I've added a lot of new, like, proteins and veggies into my everyday- Oh, excuse me, into my everyday meals. Stella Deer, doing good? I see you've been taking good care of your plants. That's good. I hope my teachings are helping in some way. You know, I used to be quite the little soldier. Uh, Midfield State University Argonomical Engineering Class of 71. Top grades and a progressive profile. I was hired right away by one of these big corporations. They put me in charge of a large parcel of land, several thousand acres. I was to maximize the output of land assets. Well, that's what I did, and believe me, I did it well. I crammed the field full of uh, transgenic seeds. When insects came, I doused them with poison. And then when the soil turns, uh, turned gray, I pumped it full of chemicals. Great powerful stems grew upon these grounds, and plentiful unnaturally enormous cobs, but underneath all laid on an unfathomable sickness. I guess it was inevitable that I met the dragon then, sooner or later. We saw that on the map, I think. All right, let's go buy our upgrade. Oh, 
that's a nice garden. Knock, knock. I'm, uh, who's there? Lettuce. Lettuce who? Lettuce in and you'll find out. Dave, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, we got a bigger boat! We got a bigger boat! Heck yeah. How expensive is the next one? 4,000, okay. Linen thread and oak plank. Interesting. I am a work leader, but I also have some whiskey now. <laughs> Stell's face was me every time Mark made a pun. I didn't see it. Fuck, I'm too busy like reading it and I miss all the reactions from Stella. I need to I need to watch for that. Chicken stir fry with pineapple and honey. Oh yum. Oh my gosh, that sounds amazing. I've been like really into pineapple lately. Um I'm one of those weirdos who likes pineapple on pizza. Like, and now I just kind of like pineapple on everything. Like, pineapple in sushi bowls and pineapple, like... I just really like it. You like it on pizza too, don't worry. <laughs> Thank you, Dave. How do I make linen thread? Warts? I don't know how to make any of these. You've upgraded the boat! That's weird. Don't tell Albert, but he left some bolts Ooh. loose. He was probably just in a hurry. Give me a second. Here we go. That did more than I thought. Here, let's see. Oh, this boat got some advanced Ooh. options now. First, you can travel safely and not go through all dangers the sea has to offer. When using your map, just uh, need to toggle on safety travel mode. It's that simple. And don't worry, it won't stay on forever. Next time you select a destination, it won't be on. I hope that helps. What else have we done here? Or what else do we have here? Oh yeah, the engine's been boosted. Now you can set up multiple destination points. That's pretty handy. You can set your course and let the wind do its job. Beside that, it's just a bigger boat with more room. Well, have fun. Try to eat, trying to eat more stir fries since you work fast food and get fast food, so uh, you want to get healthier. Yeah, that's so, it's so hard because like when you're around food that is accessible just accessible doesn't matter if it's like cheap or or expensive or quality or not like if it is easy to acquire it's that kind of that's very difficult to avoid um from farming. Yeah, I get that idea, but I, I never get that much, so... Well, maybe we can, like, buy some stuff right here, conveniently. Uh, nope. What if we try... Is there anything we can sell? Should be sold. Oh. Should be sold. Okay. Oh, fuck, I'm rich now. All right. I still don't know if that's useful for anything. All right. Well, that was actually better than I expected. I'll get that one later. Steamed shellfish. Oh, 
No, we're good. Sleep till morning. Let's go. Wait, will the boat not move when I'm sleeping? I thought it would. Guess not. Well. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Eaten this very recently. Do you have anything else? There you go. God, they're so picky. No, 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 not for me. This one said that that uh, they're not picky, but they'll only eat like two things. But not one after the other. You have to switch it. kill these. There we go. Oh, the cat's meow is so cute. Alright, got some ore. Got a lot of stuff. Anything over that way? I think that's everything, right? Were you trying to say something earlier? You're hungry, though. some coffee. <laughs> Alright, so from here... We'll go here? And I'll do like... Well... I want to, like, set two destinations. I don't know if it'll let me. Not yet. I don't know. I'll figure it out later. It's fine. Hoppy! Blank. Loom. Boundary. I don't totally know what track and untrack does. Build a sawmill. So the sawmill I just like haven't really seen the option for. I wonder if I missed something back at the uh I think I did. I think I was supposed to buy other blueprints before the one that I got because it looks like I have more advanced blueprints than I can use.
We're almost at this place, so we'll just grab what we need and then go. One thing I, I gotta say that I really like about this game is how gender ambiguous Stella is. I, I think that's really good. I like that a lot. Hundred percent agree. Yeah. Like you just really just don't don't know. <laughs> and it's not made clear at any point. Well I guess they say niece, but still. Uh I think that was it. I don't think there was very much here. That's fine, because we're gonna go back to the harbor now anyways. No naps. There is no napping on this boat. serious lack of power tools in here. Maybe that's sawmill I was talking about? Yeah, I'm working on it, man. I'm working on it. Uh, hold A, right? Nope. Hold X? Yeah. I love the cat. That does make the time pass, I will say. Did my stream crash? It went off for a second. Oh, that's so weird. Sorry, guys. That was weird. My computer made like a uh, a noise, like like you're plugging in a USB and taking it out. And I wonder if it like switched its uh, Ethernet on and off again. Weird. Well, at least we're back now. That's still really strange. Everything's like been reset on my end. <laughs> refresh a couple times. Yeah, whatever. Technology, man, what can you do? Yeah, what can, what can you do? What can we do? Like my OBS didn't crash at all, which is weird. OBS is just like But then Twitch is like, oh no, you started streaming two minutes ago. Whatever. Whatever, whatever, whatever game, whatever. It's fine. So weird. Build. So I have linen. So I think I just need quartz, 
which I just like don't have. So we could go to that town again. Man. That was bad timing though. Let's go see where else we can run to to maybe get some stuff. Resources. Quartz. That's what we need, right? Let's go there. I think I'm going to check that out and then I'll probably call it for the night. So give it another like 20 minutes or so. it out. Let's see. Are you hungry? You're a little hungry. Look, I got coffee. Everybody's getting a cup of joe. Are you gonna take it? Not hungry right now. Okay. Who says no to coffee? Man. Or is it? That's what I call a perfect blend of coffee that hits the spot. Mm. You would tea, please. I am a big tea fan. I need to make some more cold brew for tomorrow. Here, we can go sing to some some carrots. That's the wrong button. We'll sing to these carrots. Go, cat, go. Wait, there's another one? Oh, we just, we went through something. We went close enough. It's convenient. Hey, thanks, Dream Elements. Thanks for the notification. Well, maybe it'll let some people know who were here and got kicked out that, uh, that we're, we're still around. I really like that the longer you do it, the more the music picks up. I think that's a really good touch. Are we gonna get some lightning? I'm ready for some lightning. Although I don't think we like drove our boat through through it at all. I wonder how long this game is. I hope it's at least 20 hours. Sure, Allie. I thought that might be it. The dragon. 
I guess it is inevitable that he would be here, following me, always, even in this world. Our destiny is, well, they're intertwined, are they not? Still, for all the harm it has done me, it looks quite in pain. Doesn't it? The rocks on its back seem to be oozing with corruption. Perhaps chipping away at them might soothe it? Go ahead, Stella. All creatures deserve love and care. Do what you do best. hours? Alright, sweet. Sometimes I worry with games like this about just going through them too quickly, you know? Because I really want to, like, take my time and enjoy it. But I also don't want to feel like I should keep my stream short so that I can space it out. is a good one for that. It's not short, but it's not overly long either. Cool. Incredible! It looks relieved, doesn't it? I wonder what it means. If we ever cross this dragon's path again, I think we should help it. However I might feel about it for now, though, I need some time to collect my thoughts. Thank you, Stella, for everything. An old acquaintance. Have some coffee. Give her a hug. That helped. Good. Hugs can do a lot. But now... We have enough for this? Heck yeah. Can we build anything else or add it? Not yet. There's going to be some other quest item that gets us there. Oh, it's like sleep time. No wonder. I was like, where is everybody? Different fish when it rains. 
Maybe they'll come up to drink fresh water that's dripping down. Pretty neat. Okay. Nope, let me out. I mean, I guess I'll guess I'll do some some fishing real quick. The eel sushi. Oh my gosh. A message in a bottle. good it it like i feel like the flavor of eel is not very strong like it has a kind of interesting texture to it but it doesn't have like an overly distinct taste um but the sauce that they put on it is amazing i feel like i half get it for the sauce but my favorite sushi is uh an eel and sweet potato roll black tiger shrimp all right we are getting a bunch of weird stuff let's do one more Nice catch, Sprout. You just fished out a bottle from the sea. That's not trash. It could be anything in there. Tiny ship, old wine, baby crab. Yeah, it could even be trash. Go ahead, crack it open. Uh, how? Nope. Nope. <laughs> if I push all the buttons, eventually I'll find it. There we go. Greetings. Oh! Oak Forest and Serenity of the Magnificent Rice Fields available now in Gurren Fields. <laughs> it does. It, yeah, it's a brochure. That's funny. I thought it was a recipe at first. Thought it was like, oh, I can make rice now. No. Linen. Oh, hey, Harvey. Hey, buddy. You guys, Harvey came over to say hi. He missed you. Hey, the camera's over there. I'll look up. Aww. Let's see. It's okay, bud. Try to just get the controller. All right. Oh, what am I doing? Oh, I get it. So now we just need, like, wooden planks or something? We need one log! Ah, uh, exactly one log. Oh my gosh. Alright, Harvey, you've been a good sport, good boy.
He's such a good sport, this cat. He hates being picked up, but he doesn't run off whenever I'm done. Or, or whenever, whenever I, like, pick him up and I put him down, he's, he's just, like, chill with it. Alright. I think this is a good place to end for tonight. I'm getting kind of hungry. I need, I need a little bit more food. So as Harvey leaves, so do I. Um, but let's see who is online. We can drop a raid. Uh, I also want to say Ali, Hedroski, Nine, Dave, thank you so much for those resubs. I really, really appreciate it. Thanks again to Lizzie for that raid. Definitely go check them out if you haven't already. Um, and thanks for the some of the new follows today. Yarn Pumpkin and Seamus shared some bits. Chris, thanks for that follow. All right, let's see who's online. Let's pull up Twitch.